love stock eliminator and uh, we normally have to race stock in Sweden because in the UK we don't have NHRA stock. Um, we've been racing in Sweden for quite a few years and we figured well we've got to go to the home of the, the best racing in the world so we've got to come to the you know, US and um, we're just having a ball. We were out here last year with my brother's car which was a double A SA car and that car went home and we uh, shipped the Nova out and did a divisional in July and raced at Bowling Green and here we are. It's just something about a car with a four speed, letting that clutch out, Lee spring car, these things are wild to drive. It used to be an automatic car, um, change to the stick and I just have so much fun with it. The car, you go down the track and you're really fighting it, you know, and it's like driving an old pro stock car, it's just so much fun. And uh, once you've had the stick, you never go back. I built the car as a race car in 2007. Just did them some bracket racing at home, and it, it just kind of developed into a stocker car. Uh, and then we, we were racing in Sweden, where they have NHRA stock. And uh, the kind of the dream has always been to come to the US. And um, so we just just continually developing the cars. What all did you guys have to go through to get your car here? It's pretty easy. We do. There's a company in England um, called Cars, and they they kind of ship cars all around the world, like like high end cars. And basically, we drop the car off at a dock, the docks in England. They take care of everything, and it takes like eight days for the car to come to the US. We pick it up in New York, and um, yeah, it's just uh, it's pretty easy. Tell me what it means to you to race at the US National. Oh, I mean, it just. I'm going all goose pimply now thinking about it. I mean, it's just unbelievable. You, you go on YouTube and you watch all the old, the legendary races, Bill Grumpy Jenkins, all the old guys, and it's just, you feel so special. You're on the same turf as all these famous guys that you look, they're my heroes, you know, for this type of stuff. And I don't know, it just sends you, uh, gets the goosebumps going. It's, it's unbelievable.